The Sullivan County prosecutor today filed charges against a man accused of having explosive devices. Now federal investigators are taking a look at the case as well. News 10's Joe Ostrowski talked to the deputy Sullivan County prosecutor today. Joe, what can you tell us? Well, Patrice, this all started on Friday when police arrested Blake Bowles on a warrant. When they checked his pockets, they reported finding two pipe bombs. They say when they went to Bowles' home on East Washington, they found five more of those pipe bombs. And they also reported finding a booby trap device made of a propane tank and a shotgun shell. And they reported finding items used to make meth. Earlier today, county prosecutors charged Bowles with a series of crimes, including possession of a destructive device, dealing meth, possessing drug-making material, maintaining a nuisance, and possessing a syringe. Now, authorities say charges like these, dealing with explosive devices, are unusual. No, it's not common. Of course, the meth problem is, um, and uh, but not, no, we don't typically see uh, possession of devices such as these. Um, I mean, th this particular individual, the reason he was engaged is he had a warrant uh, out for uh, allegedly pointing a firearm at another individual. Now, Deputy Prosecutor John Springer says investigators are checking out those other devices found in Bowles' home. And he says federal officials have also been in town to check on the devices. No word yet on any federal charges in this case. Mark, Patrice, back to you. Thank you, Joe.